Hey guys, what's up? Welcome to Pro Tools Help. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to open a plugin called the Kramer HLS EQ inside of a Pro Tools session. Talk to you guys a little bit about it, make you understand it a little bit more. Let's go into my, uh, sorry, Pro Tools, not the trash. <laughs> Let's go into uh, insert multi channel plugin EQ. We're going to go down to Kramer HLS. Keep in mind that you got to have uh, certain Waves plugins in order to have this uh, uh, EQ right here. Uh, I don't want you guys to get confused if you guys just bought Pro Tools and you, you view this video and then you open up Pro Tools and you, you expect to have this uh, audio suit in your, <coughs> in your Pro Tools. So basically, this is an EQ. This is a really good EQ, actually. Um, you can choose between uh, mic and line in. Line in basically is like an instrument or something like that. You have a preamp on this EQ, which is really good. Not a lot of EQs have that. Uh, it shows you your bass frequencies. <clears throat> it shows you uh, your your mid frequencies and shows you your high frequencies. Now, basically, what's nice about this is you can cut. <clears throat> you can cut. So basically, this 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 shows you, this 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 lets you pick the frequency range and this this helps you cut or gain on it. Uh, same goes for mid and same goes for high. Again, this is a really cool uh, EQ. I'd suggest you try this because it's really, really good and really helpful. Uh, if you guys have any further questions, please uh, inbox me. I'd love to get back to you guys and help you guys. And keep in mind that in the future videos, I'm going to show you guys how to use these in depth. Uh, I'm going to show you guys how to EQ. I'm going to show you guys how to compress. I'm going to show you guys all that good stuff and make you better at what you do. Uh, please subscribe and enjoy, guys.